We start tonight with the West Coast Conference Tournament coverage. First, a win by the Gonzaga women over Pacific this morning. And then within the last hour, the Gonzaga men just hope, took home rather the dub against San Francisco. Grem 2's Travis Green is joining us live from Las Vegas tonight with the breakdown of the men's game tonight. Travis? Hey, Mark. Now, this is the definition of hot off the presses. Gonzaga men entering today looking to do what the Gonzaga women already did earlier in the day and punch their ticket to the WCC Tournament Championship. But to do so, they have to get past third seeded San Francisco, a team Gonzaga has already beaten twice this season. Early on, it seemed things would be easy. The very first bucket of the game, Ryan Emhar, the alley, Anton Watson, the oop. But easy, it was not. San Fran would catch fire beyond the arc. Marcus Williams would score 10 points in the half. Later in the first, Ryan Beasley knocking down one of seven triples the Dons would make in the half for an eight-point San Fran lead. But with under a minute and a half to go, Zags get a huge spark. Nolan Hickman, I see your three. Here's mine. Maybe the biggest bucket of the game coming from Dusty Stromer off the bench. This really woke up the Gonzaga crowd here at the Orleans. A three that suddenly gave the Zags a 36-35 lead. Bulldogs still had more scoring to do before the break. Ryan Nemard, how's your jumper? Yeah, it's good. Two of his 14 as the Zags miraculously led at the break. That momentum would carry over to the second half where Ben Gregg would take over the game. Back-to-back -back triples for Lil Ben Gregg. He had 14 points in just the second half, 17 in total. But Nolan Hickman also can't talk about him enough. Exploding in the half as well for 15 points. He had a team high 20 on the night. Zags punched their ticket to the WCC Tournament Championship. 89 to 77. We have a rematch against St. Mary's coming up. Here's Ben Gregg on the big night. Uh, me and Travis Knight watch a show called Ted Lasso. And the big thing is called uh, we got to be a goldfish and have a short memory. And that's what he told me. And I was like, yeah, you're right. You got to forget about having the first half and come out and keep shooting my shot. I know it's going to go in. I worked so hard on it. Um, and these guys gave me all the confidence in the world to tell me to keep on shooting it. So kept letting it fly and finally made a couple. It's a good feeling. Question in the back over there. He definitely made a couple. And when you look at this team, they've caught fire of late, came out a little slow here. They had eight days off before this game. That's understandable. Maybe they caught that fire they had at the end of the season and carry it into tomorrow. They'll face St. Mary's, the trilogy is what you could call it. These two split the regular season series one to one for the WCC Tournament Championship. That game tips off at 6 p.m. tomorrow. We'll have all your coverage out here in Vegas. For now, I'm Travis Green from the Orleans Arena. All right, Mark, Travis, thank you. you very much. Get some sleep out there, buddy.